वेलकम बैक आफ द ब्रेक अनु मलिक सेमिनल सॉन्ग देखो बारिश हो रही है इट्स रेनिंग इज एम्बलमेटिक ऑफ द एंटायर कंट्री करेंटली मॉनसून कंटिन्यूज टू रीक हैवक अक्रॉस इंडिया एंड स्पेशली इन स्टेट्स लाइक गुजरात एंड महाराष्ट्र दे आर अंडर रेड अलर्ट इन गुजरात एज मेनी एस टेन डिस्ट्रिक्ट इन सौराष्ट्र एंड अदर डिस्ट्रिक्ट फ्रॉम साउथ गुजरात आर ऑलरेडी इन अनडेटेड सेवरल पीपल हैव बिन मूव टू रेस्क्यू स्पॉट्स मीन वायल महाराष्ट्र एज नाशिक डिस्ट्रिक्ट दी आई एम डी हैज इश्यूड अ रेड अलर्ट टिल द फोर्टीन ऑफ जुलाई forecasting heavy to extremely heavy rains of over 20 cm that's over millimeters in 24 hours pune and gadchiroli districts too have been witnessing downpours for the last few days now we're joined by my colleague akash sharma who is live with us from hidayat nagar navsari in gujarat good morning to you akash uh, a lot of people have been displaced in gujarat because of these rains um but what are the kind of uh, uh, destruction of infrastructure or even uh, residences that we're seeing well chilpa first of all let me tell you that we are seeing on and off rain in this particular area and while it is about this navsari district so it has been on red alert at this point in time i'm standing in hidayatnagar area and behind me you can see the visuals of this a water logged locality we are told that people who were living here have been shifted to a nearby school and at this point in time you can see that water level is you know in fact much above my knees and also let me tell you that rivers like a purna and uh, ambika river are uh, flowing above the danger level and that's the reason why uh, it is uh, people are assuming that this water level will further rise also let me tell you that while it is about the administration so several steps have been undertaken and uh, yesterday we saw how a cm uh, you know took the stock of the whole situation and in fact had a meeting with all the senior officers of uh, this particular district and somewhere instructed uh, for the uh, necessary arrangements but at this point in time somewhere the life has been affected because of uh, this continuous raining and as far as the predictions by imd so imd is saying that red alert will be uh, will be uh, observed in this uh, particular area where we can expect some sort of heavy rainfall for the next 3 days also let me tell you that uh, uh, hundreds of people have been shifted to a nearby locality but uh, talking about uh, this particular area if i can show you the visuals behind me you can see that uh, you know this area is a uh, water logged at this point in time though maximum of uh, people have been uh, shifted relocated but uh, many of them are still inside their houses they are staying at the first and second floor and uh, it has been clearly said by the administration that you need to leave this particular area because it is not at all safe now but people are not ready to leave their houses also uh, let me tell you that while it is about ndrf and state agencies so they are trying their level best to uh, you know provide a sort of help and relief to all those who are affected but at this point in time the truth is that because of this heavy rainfall uh, areas are water logged and somewhere life is affected shilpa well yes absolutely akash and thank you so much for wading into deep water to bring us that ground report i'd stay stay safe and stay dry but uh, dry that boat has left now we're also looking at assam after many decades assam has experienced horrific floods 54 lakh people have been affected the death toll rises to 192 as more than 5 lakh people in 12 districts still affected by the deluge use 18 assam northeast has launched a unique campaign called fight the flood stand with assam asking viewers to donate to the cm's relief fund your small contribution can save millions and with that i'm taking a very small break there is